Hello and welcome to week 29 of my 100 mile training, which I always kind of thought I would do an epilogue to this, um, but I was hoping I would actually complete it. So just in case you didn't see, I had to stop my 100 mile training or 100 mile race at mile 41, which kind of stinks. But um, anyway, I learned a lot from it. Um, I'm still um, super proud of it, even though it sucked. Um, I wish I could have gotten to the end. But then you think of all like those sayings that people will say like, um, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take, um, just stuff like that. So yeah, it sucks. So, um, but I'm also very happy with it too. Like up here, I know that I did um, the best I could for that day, but um, just kind of still bothered me a little bit. Doesn't mean that um, if you see me out there that you can't talk about it or say, hey, um, no one, I didn't die or anything like that, so I'm not done. Um, I think part of it is the day of the race. Um, I started maybe built it up too much or maybe got too excited and just um, started getting really nervous. And I think it really got me tense. And um, I just, just all of it got the distance, the amount of time that I was going to be out there just made me a little nervous. And I just maybe I just didn't deal with it mentally very well at the beginning. And it, then it like rolled over into physically uh, bothered me. Maybe we're like pretty much on my spine, like everywhere was just like super tight. It like rolled down to my ankle. So I just was really doing bad. Um, it sucks that I made this whole video series about it and um, then couldn't, couldn't finish it. So that part kind of stinks, but I don't know. I probably will try it again someday. We'll have to see. Um, it might not be for a couple years because I got to build up to it again, but I'm definitely not um, done running, definitely not done being an ultra marathoner, even though during the race I kind of thought maybe, you know, ultra marathon racing just isn't for me, but, you know, it probably is for me. I'm just never, I mean, I'm not going to be um, getting first place or anything like that ever, but I can still um, run really far for a long time, um, and um, it really is difficult just to get yourself to start the race. Um, I don't know if I can emphasize that anymore. Um, I think I said, you know, in, in a video that you could do it too. So you definitely can do ultra marathon. I mean, you could trade for a hundred marathon, make it, or you could do what I did and, and not make it. So um, there is a lot of chance once you start running this far. After this, I've kind of talked to a lot of people that weren't able to make it um, and had DNFs too. So it um, makes you feel a little bit better but um, thank you for everyone that sent messages texts watch this video series all the way through um, this will be the last video in this 100 mile series but i am definitely starting something new next week i've already filmed a bunch of it and i'm starting to film even more so um, look forward to seeing that and um, if you want to be in that video and you haven't already been just let me know and i'll get you in there so um, anyway i'm gonna enjoy my quick trip got a frozen coke um, you know the drink of champions so um, I feel really good still I've already been running um, so if you feel bad or feel like you can't talk about it to me that don't feel like that at all um, I'm totally good and I'm healthy and I am still running and I'm mentally still there too so anyway again thank you for watching all this time so I'm going to go ahead and go and finish my drink and get ready for the next thing. So thank you for watching and I will talk to you next time.